In an ideal world, your Xero accounts will be connected to a bank feed and all you have to do is come in, go into your bank and all the transactions will be there ready for you to deal with. If you can't do that, the other option is you can download a CSV and upload that and again, it will appear in the bank feed screen. But what if you can't do either of those or you create a manual transaction? The most common one tends to be if you have a petty cash account where they're all entered manually. Then if that's the case, how do you reconcile them? So for example, here in the bank feed, if I click this one and then I go over to account transactions, and go down to the 9th of April, I will see there it is. And it says reconciled. But here we have some transactions that have been entered manually they clearly didn't come through the bank feed. Now, usually what they are are payments on invoices. If you know a payment on an invoice has come through, you pay it off manually under the customer or under the supplier if it's you paying it out. And it appears in here. And it can wait for a downloaded bank feed and then you match it up. But if there isn't going to be a match up and you've added this in, often as well, it could be a bank feed has come down but it's missing transactions, that's not unusual. So what we want to do is manually reconcile them, turn this into this. So it's quite simple. Now, if you come up here, you'll see that there's no option to do anything other than remove and redo a transaction. So how do we get the markers reconciled to work? If we're in a bank account, so for example, if we were back over here, we would have to actually click on the bank account name, come into this screen, and then we will go up to where we see a question mark, which is the help, click on that, and you'll see enable mark as reconciled. If we turn that on, and you'll see automatically, it gives you the option to mark as reconciled. The beauty of this is not only can you individually mark as reconciled, but you can mark multiple transactions. So for example, I could search on status or sort on status and it will give me all the ones that are reconciled. And if I want them all to change because I'm confident that they are on the bank statement or they are cash transactions that definitely took place, all I have to do is click on each one or click on the individual one, click up here, mark as reconciled, Markers reconciled, confirm. Now you'll see a warning comes up that basically says, are you sure? You can click and turn this off if you want to. I always tell my clients until they're really confident to leave it there because then they can always double check they haven't made an error. So click markers reconciled and there you go. If you don't want any of your users to be able to do this, you can again turn it off. So again, as you can imagine, go back up to the help and click Enable Markers Reconciled, turn it off, and it's gone. Hope that helps.